Hey guys, what's up? It's having me with Game guys, episode one <laughs> of this series. So I didn't want to make this a series because for many reasons, and one of the reasons is because if you guys read the title, it says a uh, pusher rating to 3,800 and I'm already at 34. So I kind of wanted to make a little short series of me picking off from 34 to 38. So I hope you guys don't mind about that. This is just going to be a little bit of raids. Uh, probably 34 raids of me in Champions League, fails, wins, blah, 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 clutch raids. So anyways, in this raid, talking about clutch, this raid was the clutchest raid I had with Barch. I was trying out Barch for my first time in Champions, and I was like, okay, it's not too bad. So <laughs> I was actually wrong. I was really wrong about that. Um, and I've been, I've Barched this base before, and I was like, okay, so if I Barched this base before, I can do it again. So anyways, I was kind of in a tight situation here. It wasn't like I expected. I was trying to get some percentages with the lightning spells, and that already means that you're going out wrong. So I had 43%, two heroes, two lightnings, and one clan castle in the other troops, which wouldn't really matter at this point. So I was sweating bullets right here. I was like, oh no. <laughs> and I was just zooming in and out. I was like, oh my god. So uh oh by the way this doesn't have audio because this is kind of like i recorded it from my ipad so anyways this raid oh my god look at this so i deployed my heroes right there my barbarian king is going in my clan castle is going in and my barbarian king is trying to get in that wall which does take all of his health away he dies really quickly his barbarians don't stand a chance and those freaking archers don't even stand a chance so look at this oh my god look at that oh man <laughs> So, Archer Queen just clutched the whole freaking raid. I would have lost like freaking 40 trophies if I would have, you know, lost that raid. And eventually I only got two trophies. So, in this one, the color looks different a little bit because I did record it for my Elgato. And it does have sound, so that's a little plus for that. Um, so, I was raiding and I found this. And it was a 42 cup trophy offer. And I was like, okay, so... This is gonna be it. Uh, I'm gonna raid this. And I saw those level 2 infernos. I was just so excited. I misplaced that free spell. <laughs> and <laughs> I, I was just so excited for this raid. I was like, no, just whatever. I'm just gonna be whatever. I'm gonna try to get that 2 star. Well, I tried to go for the 1 star because that's usually what I try to get. I don't really care about the 2 star because if I go for the 2 star, I actually fell and I go for 1 star. Then it actually turns out that I get a 2 star. So it kind of is confusing to me. But, um, luckily my P.E.K.K.A. and King went to the middle and the whole base just went out on a trip. So, look at this. Everything is just gone. 45%. We still have a P.E.K.K.A. We still have two P.E.K.K.A.s. A Queen and, uh, what else? We have, I put my Queen on, what is it called? Her ability? <laughs> and I have a P.E.K.K.A. outside, which didn't really matter. So, this was 28 cups. Oh, my God. So, in this last raid, I found this town hall outside, and this was a 32 cup trophy offer, I believe. So I was like, you know what? Every time I find some trophies, um, yeah, some trophies outside the town hall outside, I will go for the two star anyway. So don't put your town hall outside, you know, save yourself from me. So regular go wipe, and I just go in from this right, right side, and then I deploy a jump spot right there, and I see his clan has the troops. I was like, no problem, just put a lightning spell there. I saw his dragon. Dragons don't really do anything and get go wipe, so you didn't really have to matter about that. Um, and then right here, I was kind of confused. I was like, is it going to make it? And then I saw a whole bunch of packages, you know, rain out of that little circle right there. I, everything was just clutched together. I was like, okay, so I was kind of scared because when you see stuff clutched together, you don't even know if it's going to be winning or just it's dying right there in a circle right there. So. I was kind of, you know, scared, but then once the package just spread it out like rain, I was like, okay, so let me just get the 50%, and then I picked up the 50%. I was trying to get some loot as well with the queen down there. A little golem trying to do his thing, <laughs> and I think that should be it for this raid. We have 14 seconds, 13 seconds left. I was just trying to get some loot, but there was no more loot in the bottom, so I was just trying to get some more extra percentages, I guess. That's what I always do because my I put my queen on, you know, uh, boost. So it really doesn't matter for me. So this was 21 cups. So many gold. Not so many elixir, but 
um that was a pretty nice raid and i really love the race so that should be it guys looking at where we are standing right now 3486 that's where we're gonna be uh you know picking up from the next episode not really but i'll show you guys some raids and i'll see where i left off in the next episode so that should be it guys i hope you guys enjoyed this episode of raiding 2 or something i will name it <laughs> and uh, please write comment subscribe for more videos and as always have a good me out peace Maybe I've been slipping back, dead in south, car sick on a Tuesday, missing cash, blacking out, heartless in a few ways, shipping back, double shredded, I help things steady like too late, please calm the road down, I'll do whatever you say, I get it, I get it, I'm living too hard and it's time that I stop it, but rising on up and then tumbling down while it's part of the process, Bar tabs on a hot night in a cold basement, you say I'm crazy, but I feel amazing.